above our location. He said he heard shots yesterday at that same location, several, and probably heard up to 12 shots today. Citizen at 2123 Arch Stage heard shots yesterday at the same location. Uh, Guardian 1. Guardian 1. We're overhead, however, it's going to be uh, pretty hard for us to see here because of the fog. Guardian 1's overhead, but there's a lot of fog. Also, for you, that's on the shooting. We have a person calling in from Hiawatha Playfield, 2700 California Southwest. He's someone sitting on a bench that he thinks is suspicious, doesn't know if it's related. He's on a bench, a white male, black baseball cap, dark shirt, dark pants, 2700 California Southwest. Frank, Will 81, are you guys anywhere where you can take a peek at that Hiawatha playfield issue? Four Paul on south. William 81, uh, that's a negative. We are uh, essentially above you on the hill. Green Chief. Four Paul on south. Emergency. Four fall. Yeah, I have um, an injury accident here at airport and industrial way. Uh, airbag, airbag was deployed in, on one of the vehicles. Airport and industrial receipt. Are you involved? Negative. It was a non view. Ocean 11 for injury accident. Copy and route. Car 25. Car 25. Let's go to priority calls for West Seattle until further notice. Receive, do you want this on attack? Yeah, if you can get one warmed up in staff for us, that'd be great. Four Paul. Four Paul, can you go to data if you need medics? Zebra 10, is there a callback number that I can call the uh, complainant back at? Do you want my call taker to hang up then? Hey, Guardian 1, just to confirm, you have an officer standing next to a, or nearby a car at the residence break? We don't believe so. We call the officer at the bottom of the hill or up above the residence, up past the ravine. Okay, I'm looking almost at the end of uh, Belvedere Ave Southwest, where it ends, a sharp turn and road to the left. Um, I think it's a an officer there, but I'm not 100% sure, but there's somebody standing on the road next to a hot car. Two William 81, I need the air. We're at 2123 and 2118, Arch Place Southwest. You can hear a male yelling directly north of us. Residents here say there's a trail that goes to the north from where that house is. And hear him screaming. Two of them, advising in the area of 2123 and 2118 Arch Place Southwest. There's a male yelling directly north of There's also a trail there. You hear someone screaming. Yeah, 
Yeah, Guardian 1, uh, on that trail just south of those residents there, I got somebody on the trail about 100 yards down. Guardian 1, she's a male on the trail about 100 yards down. I see a hotspot, not a male. Correction, hotspot. North of the residence, I can hear the mail shouting help on uh, my side of the ravine due north of the house. Can hear the mail yelling on the north side of the ravine. Car 25. Car 25. We're going to put this on the TAC, uh, TAC 1. Can I have all units switch to TAC 1 that are on this event? Copy that. Guardy 1 on uh, Seattle South TAC is the same as TAC 1. Guardy 1's on uh, TAC 1. 2 Frank, Willie 71, do you copy TAC 1? Chief Frank, radio, could you uh, have South make sure that Willie 71 switches over? Keep rolling, we're waiting for you in the road. Steven, do you get any longer to this call? William 71, are you on tech one? William 71. Just checking there on tech one. Okay. Was it William 81? Hey, firm. We can see where the trail leads to the north, but also the duplex just to the east or northeast of 2123 Arch Place sits right above the suspect in question residence. Duplex East, Guardian to the Suspect 
so units are aware of our location. We are going to back out just a little bit and hold containment on this because uh, we can see the trails leading up directly from the house. Received and the caller on our place says Darren just fell in the bushes and he's saying he needs a medic. Have any suspect or victim in sight. I believe our caller has him back in sight. Guardian one. Guardian one. Yeah, the female officer. What what's the address she's at right now? Guardian 1, is anyone down on that trail right now? Are there any units on the trail? Guardian 1, just to your left, that light colored house, that's where we can hear the screaming coming from. Yeah, I see a couple people down on the trail. Are any officers down on the trail? If not, then there's somebody down on the trail. Frank, we should not have any officers out on trail. Okay, you got it. There's three of us that are not on a trail, that are on a gravel driveway where Hill meets Victoria just to the north of the house. Okay, for the three officers that are on the uh, the gravel driveway, you're hearing noises off to the or screaming off to the north, correct? Our south and we're to the north. Possible shots fired. Happy possible shots fired. Guardian 1. Guardian 1. Okay, to those three officers that uh, told me that the screaming was to the south, I got a person uh, laying down on the ground next to a bunch of vehicles just south of them. Probably 50, 100, 100 yards, 50 yards. Okay, 
heavily treed and or bush and lots of bushes. Uh, okay, there's a uh, there's like another driveway that comes up from the from the south and ends right down below you guys um, off of Belvedere, I believe. Okay, the subject is uh, moving around now. Uh, good, good. Turn the road. Back out, pull forward. Guardian 1, are they making contact? We're calling the suspect to us right now. Hold the airplane. Martinez to the crew at the Bearcat. The witness is saying that there's likely other shooters out here. Deaver 2, we have one in custody. You can open the air. Bearcat 2, can you move up to us? Uh, Guardian 1 to the unit. The units at the Bearcat. Yeah, if you continue up that road past those abandoned vehicles where he came out, there's a trail that kind of goes up the hill a little bit there. There's another uh, hot spot up there. Copy that. we got to pass the suspect up. we move up there if you can keep an eye on that, please. Will do. Way to the squad view by, you got a shed on the hillside just... North of the house. Two seven one to zebra two. If we can have someone on your Bearcat crew that can start debriefing that guy and give us a sit rep on what's going on. 
party being done. Copy that. And is that subject injured? Probably has a laceration or some kind of uh to the head. It's not bad. It is a little conscious for you. Two seven one to the crew of the uh, suspect in custody. What's that suspect's name? We're in the process of bringing the female and the male back to the CP using Bearcat two. Copy that. We have Darren Atwood with us at this time. Copy that. And 271, just for intel, that Darren Atwood is the person that we believe was initially reported as down on the porch break. reported as having been down on the ground with a gun next to him. And have we secured the gun? all over the place. He is secure. Two seven one. Two seven one. Now zebra two. We got the female. We got the one male possible suspect. He's got a little cut on his face. He's bleeding. Not get a lot of cooperation from him. I don't know if he's high or intoxicated. I'm gonna send both of them back down to the command post in Bearcat two. 
Copy that. Car 25. Car 25. Car 25, call the CD. Guardian 1 to the uh, Bearcat. Bearcat, go ahead. Yeah, that other hot object I saw it turned out to be a, a light post. Copy that, thank you. Uh, Guardian 1, do we have everybody accounted for? Unknown at this time. Chief up 1, Doug. Bearcat 2, what's your ETA back to the CP with those two? Zebra 2, 271, they're slowly backing away down the hill now, just started. Copy that. Frame 3 to Willie 81, where are you in relation to where your bikes are? Just north of, in between 2118 and 2123. Take the little trail down.
271. What was that last? I'm going to move up and check this, uh, this truck, see if we can move out of the way. Traffic for Coolidge. If you do move that, just move to the side. Leave the Bearcat down there for now. You got a referee seat, I guess. We made it all the way to the top. There's a couple more houses up here. Leave the Bearcat down there for that for the time being. Copy. Here at Cancock. Guardian one. Guardian one. Yeah, I searched pretty much all downhill from where the uh, SWAT guys were down to the bottom and didn't see any other unusual spots in the woods. debrief these two, find out more intel about what occurred. Based on what we get from them, we'll ultimately be uh, acting off that, but we'll probably uh, need you to formulate a plan to clear whatever unsecured homes you have up there that were involved in this. Right now, break. Uh, 
above 2115, we believe where the female was calling from, right off the stairwell of the Bearcat. We have a uh, visual under some of those windows inside that house. Um, right. We're just doing a quick sweep of the yard up here to make sure there's nothing that needs to be pressing up here, and we'll start working our way back down towards that house and uh, see all we can do with that. Copy. Uh, can we get a barricade up there as a base of operation to work off of? Greg and I 